Hey beautiful ladies, thanks for checking out my channel. In this video, we are going to do a eye tutorial showing you how to get this gorgeous eye look that is definitely has some St. Patrick's Day vibes, but you can totally rock all year round because it has some really gorgeous, like earthy tones to it. So be sure to check out the tutorial that's coming next. So first, we are going to apply Mocha Java to the crease as a transition color. As always, when you apply a transition color to your crease, you want to apply it high enough so that you can see it when your eye is open. So you apply it above the crease and blend it up towards your brow bone. Okay, next we are going to put Mystic Moss in the inner corner of my eye. Which this is a little bit different than I usually do. I usually put the darker color on the outer corner, but this look has it in the like middle part and it looks really pretty. So we're going to give it a shot. So I'm going straight in with the doe foot applicator and kind of painting it on my lid where I want the color. Then I'm using a brush and I'm basically just patting that pigment in and blending it a little bit, but I really want to keep the pigment where I placed it. Okay, next we are going to put rose gold glitter in the outer half, okay? So this is where it's like, usually I put the glittery, like lighter color in the middle, but this one had it in the outside. So we're going to try something new. When using glitters, I like to take the flat brush and take the product directly off the doe foot applicator and then pat the product onto my eye where I want to have it placed. Um, this really helps keep the like glitter really like concentrated. And also, if you're putting the glitter on top of a different color, like how I'm kind of blending it over the Mystic Moss, if you blend back and forth, sometimes the glitter particles can kind of scrape off the undercolor. All right, we're also going to put it in the inner corner. Now, since this is just a really small area, I am using the doe foot applicator to kind of place the rose gold where I want it. And then I'm using a small brush to kind of pat it in. Okay, next we are going to put Mystic Moss again on the lower lash line and kind of smudge it up. Now I'm using a small like precision smudge brush to apply the Mystic Moss as like a smoky lower liner across all across the bottom and then the inspiration photo had it kind of go up towards the cat eye as well. Um, if you don't have a brush you can do it with a q-tip as well. All right now I'm gonna put on some mascara and now I'm gonna do the other eye. What do you think? This is fun right? Totally love these colors like Mystic Moss is one of my favorites. Like the earthy green is just so gorgeous, especially paired with rose, rose gold glitter. It's like perfection. Um, it was really fun to kind of play around with the different placements. Like I said, I think um, if you would have given me these three colors to use together, I would have placed uh, Mystic Moss in the outer corner and rose gold glitter just at the inner. Um, but it was kind of fun to see um, a different inspiration um, photo and kind of play with um, different shadow placements than I normally um, would have done. So. There you go. This is the luck eye look. Um, definitely some St. Patrick's Day vibes, but totally like wearable all year round, especially if you like wearing these like earthier colors. So there you go. If you have any questions, let me know if you want to order these colors. Um, like I said, Mystic Moss is currently limited edition. I really hope they bring it back full time, but it is limited edition still available. Um, you can shop at www.sengents.com slash North Star Beauty find the link in um, the description below as well. Um, but feel free to message me at any time with any questions or color suggestions. Thanks for watching. Bye.